Hello again for USCFSales.com. I'm Steve Lopez with another Fritz video tip for you today. Once in a great while over the years I do hear from users who complain about Fritz's drawing or resignation tendencies. Either it doesn't resign in a lost position or it won't accept a draw when the person thinks that Fritz should accept a draw, etc. You can tweak these. I'm going to show you how to do that today. It's a very simple little tweak. First thing I want to show you, though, is that when you are playing a game, and you probably have noticed this if you have played against Fritz and taken a look at the menus, then in the default menu, the home menu, there are buttons here for resigning and offering a draw. They're grayed out right now because I'm not in a game, of course. But I can, you know, of course, resign, you can do that at any time. I could resign right here. I mean, if I make one move, Fritz makes a move, I could click resign and quit on the spot. Uh, you know, if I play E4 and Fritz plays the Sicilian and I decide I don't want to play a Sicilian today. So you can resign at any time, but offering a draw is a little bit trickier. Um, there are certain conditions under Fritz will be more apt to accept a draw than others. The big thing is, I think, one thing I've noticed is that Fritz doesn't want to take a draw if you're still in the opening book. It wants to be out of the book. Uh, because the, the the idea of accepting a draw is tied directly to the analysis functions down here when Fritz is thinking. Uh, the closer you are to a dead even position, the, the more Fritz will be inclined to take a draw, particularly if you're winning. If you're in what's close to a dead even posi position, but let's say you're a half pawn ahead, uh, and you offer a draw, Fritz is going to go, oh yeah. <laughs> But there are ways you can tweak that, and I'm going to show you how to do that. But but that's where you offer a draw right here. You have the offer draw button. You click on that, and uh, Fritz will either accept or reject your draw offer. You'll get a pop-up that'll that'll give you the information. Here's how you tweak it, though. You go over here to the application menu, and our old friend, the options button, down here at the very bottom, where you can set options for the program, and you've got all kinds of different tabs here where you can click on different things and if you go to the game tab you have two boxes right here that are very important for setting these tendencies you have resign and draw I talked about at the top of the video about Fritz's resignation tendencies um, sometimes if you are clobbering the software if you're playing it in friend mode or, or one of the handicap modes and and you're beating a tar out of it it'll quit it'll resign and some people don't like that they want to play it out to a mate for example what you want to do then is you want to set resignation to never basically Fritz will never quit you'll have to checkmate Fritz or end the game in some other manner, a stalemate, you know, whatever, you know, insufficient material, whatever it happens to be. You have to play it out to a conclusion. That's if you click never. If you click late, um, Fritz will resign, but only late in the game and if you're really, really clobbering it materially. I mean, you're going to have to be up gobs of material before Fritz will quit. Early means that Fritz will be more apt to resign when it gets behind in material. Now, I don't know the exact values. I don't have access to the guts of the program to be able to look at it and see exactly what conditions Fritz will resign under. But you will find, for example, if you set it for early, perhaps you might go a rook up on Fritz. It'll quit. It'll resign. It'll throw in the towel to decide there's no point in going on. Or as late, it may have to be a queen plus before it will resign. And if you select never, it just plain won't quit. You're going to have to go on and on and on. Draw, the same basic ideas apply here. If you click never, Fritz will never accept a draw offer. Even if a position's dead even, it's not going anywhere, Fritz is not going to take a draw. Late, obviously it's going to accept a draw, but you're going to have to be a whole lot closer to dead even for it to take a draw, or perhaps you're going to have to be winning, actually in a winning position for it to take a draw, whereas early, you know, if it's dead even, if there's, you know, and there's not much going on in a quiescent position, it'll be more apt to take a draw if you select early. That's how you do it. It's very simple. There's not much more to it than that. Uh, just you're going to select your options. I believe the, the defaults are late for both of these, but you can set it so that Fritz will never resign. You'll have to play it out to mate and never draw. You'll have to, you know, really force a conclusion. The other, the opposite of that is early and early. Uh, Fritz will quit early if you get material up on it. Fritz will accept a draw. Perhaps even if it's, even if in the evaluation down here, it's maybe even winning by a little bit, like a quarter or a third of a pawn, it'll still take that draw. 
you know, again, we don't, I don't have the exact numbers, but you get the idea. This is where you can tweak those settings. And it just surprises me sometimes that people will write me these furious emails or call me on the phone and, and just be really angry about this, where they've never gone in and taken a look here and found this. <clears throat> Excuse me. I encourage you to kind of play around with the program. Um, go to, let me set this back, by the way. Go to the application menu, by the way, and select options and look at different settings. If you're not sure what they do, click the help button and you'll get some information. Um, for example, mark move with arrow is another one that people like to complain about. That when Fritz makes a move, it will show that move with an arrow. That way if you looked away for a minute, you can look back and you can see what Fritz played. Some people find that really irritating. Well, it's very easy to turn off or turn it on just by clicking this little check button, but people didn't go looking for it. So look through these options. If you're not sure what to do, click the help button. Uh, this stuff's here for a reason, and the help file's here for a reason, and you can change the settings of Fritz very easily. But what I want to cover right here, of course, was resignation and draw. You can tweak how often, how prone Fritz will be to throw in the towel with the resignation setting, or how readily it will accept your draw offer or occasionally I've seen Fritz make a draw offer, excuse me. <clears throat> also, um, it'll do that once in a while as well, and this is where you change that setting. Till next time for USCFSales.com, I'm Steve Lopez. Thank you for watching.